Hello again to anyone and no one who accidentally clicked on this video and welcome to a brand new Red Dead Redemption video. Uh, I got a couple random things planned today for for this video. Um, so I just started my third playthrough actually of Red Dead. Um, so actually this is my favorite game of all time. I don't know, I, I think I've probably mentioned that before. But Red Dead 2 is a really special game to me. Um, I don't know, I just... I find it outstanding. I love the story, the gameplay, basically everything about it. So it's my number one favorite game of all time. And um, yeah, I've played through it twice, like fully. Um, so I'm just going to do a couple missions here, part of the first chapter. And then I think at the end, I will try and break into the prison early. You know the prison that you go to at the at the end of the game, the one that that they keep John in. Um, this is a pretty fun mission. You get to kill a lot of a lot of enemies. So, what are we doing, Dutch? Yeah, Dutch. What are we doing, Dutch? Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Then, then I will take the lead. I love this, um, the sawed off shotgun. It's one of my favorite weapons, actually. Oh, it doesn't work very well for, with long distance. That's all right. Let's use the rifle. Let's take some cover here. Woo! Pretty sick. Oh, that's Dutch. Better not shoot Dutch. Guy up in the tower. Bam. What does this guy want? Oh, damn. Uh oh. Take cover over here. Dude, I can't hit this guy. There we go. I don't think I... Do I have dead eye yet? No, I don't... I don't think so. You have to, like, upgrade it, too. It's, like, really bad at first, the, the dead eye. Sick. There's another wave of them. Bro, the six of us single-handedly, like, took this whole group out. And we're about to take out all these guys too. Oh! <laughs> I love that shot. When it gives you that like angle. Oh, I just unlocked the dead eye. Nice. Oh shit. I'm getting a little bit too, uh,. Optimistic here. Oh my god, Arthur, why did he fall over? Oh. I'll show you my other profile after this. The one, uh... There, there's this one where I basically 100%ed the game, except I'm missing like one or two of the things on the compendium, so it's it's a little annoying. Um, maybe I'll try and actually complete that later. I think this is where that... Yeah, yeah, we gotta capture this guy. This this O'Driscoll and he he ends up becoming part of our group, um, and then he gets decapitated. So you know, sucks for that guy. I forget his name. 
Something Duffy? Come here, buddy. <laughs> Kieran Duffy, that that's it. funny because at first like I don't think they like torture him but um, they, they tie him up I think in the Valentine camp he's kind of like a hostage but eventually like he just becomes part of the group but then the O'Driscolls uh, kill him <laughs> for for joining us so it's just a tragic story all right this is a pretty fun mission um, this is the first, there's like three or four train robberies in this game. There's a few of them, but this is the first one. The train robbery in the first chapter. It's the one the O'Driscolls were going to do, but we we took the score from them, I guess. That, that's, that was what the last mission was all about. Us taking their dynamite and their plans and s okay. taking the score that they were going to score. So. But, yeah. This game just looks so beautiful visually. <clears throat> it's pretty impressive. I think it's probably still the best looking game I've ever played. Ghost of, uh, Ghost of Tsushima is up there too. Um, there are some beautiful shots in Ghost of Tsushima. For sure. Alright Bill, let's blow these tracks. I trust Bill completely. Um, he is such a smart man. I really don't think he he could possibly mess this up. Um, the TNT. There's no way. He is he's all reliable. Always there when you need him. You got it from here. Thank you, Bill. I trust you, Bill. Here it comes. Good luck. All of you. You all know what to do. Here we go. <laughs> Damn it, Bill. Shit. What have you done? Operator error. Bill, what have you done? why did they get off the horse here? So that's always, wouldn't it be faster to like, I don't know, use your horse to get over here? <laughs> Dude, they're gonna just jump on like it's a movie. It's kind of sick. All right. Did someone fall off? Come on, Lenny. I'll pull you up. I got you, brother. Lenny. Lenny! Have you seen my friend Lenny? Oh, Javier fell off. Okay. <clears throat> I think some guards up here. We, yeah. Well. That guy will see his family again. We need to stop this train! Ooh. I love how like in free roam, you can actually like, uh, you can drive the train. If you take out the driver. You can't really do much except for like speed up and slow down. Um, and it's funny because when you compare it to GTA 5, in that game the train never stops. Like, no matter what you do, it's like a running gag in GTA. Um, like, trying to stop the train. Oh, what? The, I forgot about that guy. What the fuck? <laughs> Is that the conductor? Oh. 
Oh my god, Arthur just- Arthur's a fucking beast. Yeah, that was the conductor. Stop the train! Oh, there's more of them though. <laughs> they were in the train car. They were like, what is that commotion going on out there? What is all that gunfire? They were just waiting in there for the for a dramatic moment to pop out. <laughs> oh Where's Dutch and the rest of the guys? I think they show up in like a minute or two. Oh, oh! That guy's dead. Lenny? It's too far. I can't get a headshot. Oh! I actually died? Okay, maybe I'll uh, use my cover this time. Instead of running out like a madman. Kind of like Michael's ability in GTA. You can slow down and, and aim your shot better. Okay, that guy's dead. Oh, oh! Why, where'd this guy come from? They're all jumping out of the cars at different moments. They're trying to flank us. Surprise attacks. Oh fuck, I'm gonna die again. I'm not taking- I'm not using my cover. Arthur's just a madman. He's a beast. I can't help it. This is- okay. Oh, there, there they are. There's the cavalry. Oh yeah, we've pretty much done it now. I like this part. Where you just shoot at the the thing to like intimidate them. I guess I don't know. It's pretty thick steel or whatever that is that that makes up this car. Like I don't know. Oh, they're gonna use the TNT. Okay. Cool guys don't look at explosions, but Arthur, stop! Arthur glanced over at it, man. All right. Arthur's a honorable man. We're not gonna kill these men. These guys weren't trying to kill us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get in there. So I think that's the end of this mission. Um, basically. So what I'm going to do now is I'll continue this later. I'll like with my third playthrough of this game. Um, I'm going to switch it to one of my other profiles. And we will have some fun there, I think. Uh, I think the next mission is automatically starting, isn't it? It's the one where we go to, to the horse horseshoe over... Uh, it's the camp right by Valentine. Um, and then it starts the second chapter, basically. After that mission. Yeah. East. Eastward bound. Should automatically save uh or i'll make a save and then i'll switch over to my other profile i decided to do this mission too really quickly horseshoe overlook that's that's what it was called cool and we got the fit now arthur's fit all right now i will switch over to my other profile right so this is my like 100% save. Um, I don't think it's... Well, 
it is technically 100%. Um, I don't ha I don't have all of the compendium. So I'm, I'm missing a couple, but you don't need all of these to have 100% in Red Dead. Because as you can see, in total completion, it still gives me credit for 100%. Uh, so I've done all these, all the collectibles, like all of these, the all the treasures and hunting challenges, the fish, the dinosaur bones, all the cigarette cards, and I and I found all the cigarette cards. I didn't like do the thing where you can you, you just buy a bunch. I actually went around and collected all of them, just because it felt a little bit more. Um, I don't know. Uh, not natural, I guess. I, I wanted to actually collect them all. It took a while. I had to watch like a watch a YouTube tutorial. I didn't find all. How many are there? Like 140 secret cards? No way I would find them by myself. But no, I just used like online guides. Did all the challenges, which were some of these challenges were pretty tough. Um, so uh, the gambler challenge here, because a lot of these gambler ones are just luck. Let me move my face. Uh, so gambler challenge number eight this one was absolute bullshit win three hands of blackjack with three hits oh no which one was it was it gambler challenge number 10 win three hands of poker in a row i think it was gambler number 10. yeah it was it was because most of these weren't bad like like when just win five hands of poker like that's not too bad um I think it was, yeah, it was number 10, where you have to win three in a row. So, win three hands of poker in a row is, it took me all day. It took me days, actually. It was so annoying. And if you go on YouTube, like, there's a lot of YouTubers who will do, like, um, tutorials, right? And, and, and if you see any, like, Reddit 2 tutorials or YouTubers who've covered that, and they'll do like all the challenges they'll, and they'll have like like sections so, like one video is all the gambler ones the, the other video they, they have is like all the herbalist challenges how to how to complete them all it's like a guide right an online guide and like if you go to the video for gambler or like check any gambler 10 youtube videos for tips or whatever the comments are like full of people they're just angry because it's just just pure luck like win three hands of poker in a row and it's actually it's so hard like it it took like if you read the comments, like people are like, "Wow, I've been on this for weeks." I've been. It's crazy. You just sit there and you press the X button over and over again. You just zone out at some point, and you, and you, you just keep going until you win three in a row. And it doesn't sound too hard to win three in a row, but you almost never win three in a row. I don't know. It's it's so, it's so annoying. It is like the worst challenge, uh, unless it was. What was this one? Win three hands of blackjack with three hits or more. Yeah, that's not in a row. But win three hands of poker. Yeah, it was definitely challenge. It was definitely the gambler number ten, which was insanely. It was so infuriating. And then all the herbalist ones, like just all the the things you have to collect. It, you cut. You have to collect all the different plants and stuff, and just all these challenges. The sharpshooter one's kind of cool. Yeah, you know, like just different like shooting challenges, like killing flying. Like you have to shoot birds that are in, in the air or. Whatever, kill three flying birds with three consecutive long scope rifle, whatever. Disarm three enemies without reloading or switching your weapon. Some of these were pretty fun to do. Weapons experts, a lot of these were pretty fun. Sur survivalist, whatever. So so I've done all the challenges too. Um, and it's given me credit for 100% as you see. But like I said, I am still missing a couple of these compendium things. So I want to see if I can... Yeah, okay, so I'm missing two animals. I'm missing an equipment. I'm not sure which one that is. I'll have to check online. Whatever this one is. Uh, I guess it's one of these trinkets. Um, but I'm only missing one of those. I got all the fish, all the gangs, and all the plants. There's some horses that I'm missing. So I have to study four more horses, huh? Interesting. All the weapons, though, and all... Yeah, 144 secret cards. Uh... So, you know what, though? I want to see if I can finish the animal one. So, as you can see, yeah, you have to, like, study them uh, and, like, track them to, like, get credit. Like, study, skin, kill, track, 
and then you get credit for like the whole thing. So I have like, and, it, and some of these were so hard to get too. Uh, oh, I don't even have the whole thing for, for some of these. Like I, I, I never skinned this great prairie chicken apparently, but it still shows up here in the compendium. Um, yeah, I guess to fill up the bar the whole way. So I, oh, I didn't study this one, but I killed this bird and collected them. So as long as you get a, any credit, even just a little bit, like you fill up the bar a little bit. Um, I don't know where to put my face. Eh, interesting. Hmm. So I'm missing this guy and this guy. I think this is a bird. Oh yeah, some of these birds, like, like the blue yellow ma ma macaw. I think this one was only found in the uh, Guarma. So you have to, like some of these you have to do when you're in Guarma. Um, unless you can do it when you replay missions, maybe uh, you probably can. You probably could, yeah. But let's see. Uh, so I got so this is the Western Blue Moose, and I know this is also a moose because I tried finding it. But, uh, I, I, yeah, like some of these are just so rare. Like there's so many animals in this game, like, like, like 178 animals and they all have their, their unique, like behaviors and like locations. So you have to get lucky to actually find one of the, like to like, like, trust me, like filling this up, like, and like some of these snakes are, were so rare. I remember like, and I would watch those YouTube tutorials, like go to this location at this time to find this snake and um and like I, I upgraded my satchel and some of my equipment and you, you need like perfect skins for some like some of these animals so like even when you do find because i needed like a perfect um i forget what it was it might have been the raccoon yeah i did because like if you just find any animal in the wild it's just random how well their hide is it might be a one two or a three star and even if it is a three star you have to get a perfect shot or you'll ruin the pelt so if it's like a, a raccoon, it, they're a smaller animal, so you have to use like a lighter weapon and it has to be a headshot. Or otherwise, if they're a three star, you're gonna knock it down to two or one stars. But when you see them in the first place, they might already just be a one or two star just by luck. So when you're trying to hunt like perfect pelts and perfect skins for like upgrading equipment and stuff and making the trinkets, like I, that was one of the most infuriating parts of this whole game, but it was, I don't know. It was still pretty cool. Like this animal was annoying. Uh, the opossum, I, I needed to collect so many of these perfect pelts of these guys and they're, and they're rare. They only show up at like nighttime and like the like left part of the map. Um, it was super annoying. Once you complete all of those challenges, by the way, all 90, <coughs> you're, you're given this, uh, pretty sick outfit uh, I think it's called like Legends of the East or something it's pretty cool uh, I gotta buy some herbivore bait uh, oh I must have robbed this guy earlier um, herbivore bait for the moose my horse is pretty dirty um, so I put a waypoint down I, I just watched a quick YouTube video a lot of it's just luck, like whether or not the animal shows up. Um, but apparently they had good luck in this area. Not too far from here, actually. Not, not too far from Valentine. Um, so I'll go there. I'll put down the bait where they put it. See if I can find this, this moose. Yeah, it was right here somewhere. Um, so in the video... They put the bait <clears throat> over on the other side, I think. Let's see here. Where would the where where would it be kept? Okay. There you go. If I put more than one is that more effective? I don't know. Let's try it though. Let's see. I'm probably gonna get 
something other than a moose. So the, the, the one that I'm missing is the western moose. Is what is missing from my compedium. Am I saying that right? Anyway, let's hide over here. Ooh, I see an animal already. Uh, I know I got binoculars here somewhere. It's a bison. A bison. It's a big animals, man. He's taking my... Uh... Well, he took the, the bait. Hmm. All right. That's fine. We'll try with someone else, I guess. Or, or we'll try... Maybe we'll try one more time. Maybe we can scare him off. Get out of here. I don't want to kill him. Go! Alright. Is it still there? I don't think so. Okay, he's gone. Yeah, you just gotta get lucky. I mean... So let's put a couple more. It's it that bison came in fast, man. He came in hot. Hot and ready. Okay, got some more bait. Back to the other side. I don't see anything yet. I put some more bait down over here, but uh doesn't appear to be working. I think I'm just gonna move on. I'll have to do this later. One of the things I love doing the most about this game though is being an absolute menace. So what I mean is, uh, let's see here. So I have my crossbow or, or my, my bow and arrow. Uh, dynamite arrows. Yeah, that'll work. So I got a nice group of riders up here. <laughs> it's ridiculous. It's just funny. Um, I'll often go on like these episodes where I just go, I wreak havoc and I absolutely destroy my honor. Uh, but then I'll just load up the last save so none of it, you know, so that none of it, it like, it, it, it carries over. Like I, like, I get my honor back, I have all my bullets and stuff back and I never really terrorized the town. But um, I, I've terrorized the town of Valentine so many times in this game. Just for fun. Just because, you know what, sometimes, sometimes it's fun to be a bad guy. What I'll do a lot too is, uh, I'll find a victim and just give him the, the, the good old A-Train Blue Hawk. Uh, if you know, you know. Um, yeah. I don't know. Let's see how, how far we can go though with this. I'll, I'll take on the whole town. On my way. I, I, I'll often hold up in the in the uh, in the sheriff's office here is, is usually where I hold up. Is this guy still here? Oh he's dead. This man is dead. So let's here. Let's grab some of my best weapons. Uh, Cause the same, like, like I have uh, explosive slugs here too. Like I've crafted all the like different stuff. Like look pretty pretty express bullets I like all the different types of bullets and, and stuff in all my weapons okay I need my rifle and stuff uh, the crossbow I'll keep so I can have the Let's see which one do I like um, right. oh, I only have three bullets in that one. It doesn't, uh, I don't know. I'll, I guess I'll just take 
that one. Looks like it has good damage. Okay, I want to go as 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 long as I can. Here, let's, let's rack up the biggest bounty I can. See, in GTA, you get wanted levels, but in in Red Dead, you just have your your bounty price that just that slowly increases. The more, <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? Take that, buddy. Yeah, sometimes I'll just boot up Red Dead and kill the whole town. Ooh, oh boy. What was this guy doing? He was just riding all nonchalantly through my, the, the freaking, the shootout. Alright, I think it's some time for more explosive arrows. Oh. Think about who you're messing with. Think about who you're messing with. Do that again. You know what? I have a, I have a pretty, f I have a funny idea. Um. Alright, I want to let, I'm going to let these guys kill me. Cause I could I could do this for a while. I have a lot of like health, I have a lot of like tonics and stuff to heal myself. Watch oh, his hat off. Okay, I'm gonna do something really funny. You want to see John be an absolute menace? Oh shoot! I need my I need my bone arrow. Come here, uh, Buell. Yeah, that's it. Dynamite arrows? Excellent. I got poison arrows too. It's pretty cool. Watch this. Nice game of poker, huh, fellas? Oh no, I missed. Well, I sure know how to clear a room. <laughs> um, oh, we're back to this, I see. Yeah, you take that. Uh, ooh, this one's fun. It, it burns them. Puts them on fire. Oh yeah, look at look at that man. He had he had no chance. Fat chance, slim chance. Is fat chance and slim chance the same thing? But like, I, 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 I don't, someone has to explain that to me. So deadly, cool. Oh. Saint Denis is a pretty cool city too. I think this is actually probably one of my favorite locations in the game. So I've put a waypoint at the prison that's close to here, just off the coast, near Saint Denis on the right, right side of the map. It's on its own island. So I'm going to try and find a little boat and see if I can get over there. Now I've gone there before, there, there, there is a mission that takes place there when you're saving John from the jail. But uh, you can go there in free roam if you take a boat. And I've gone there before in free roam. Uh, the guards shoot you on sight, but yeah, so it's basically just a firefight. Um, there isn't really even much to do there, honestly, but you just kind of, yeah, there's, no, there's nothing really to do over there. Um, so, I don't know, it, it's its own reward, I guess, like, you know, just, just going to the island just for fun, you know, there's no real point, but sometimes... I don't know, if you're looking for a little challenge or a little bit of fun, just head on over to the to the Sisiska Penitentiary. Penitent Penitentiary. 
Anyway, I have to find myself a boat, apparently. I think I'm going to rest up first until the morning so I can have some more sunlight because the sun, the sun's getting real low. I had to hunt a lot of birds in this uh, swampy area uh, for one of the, for one of the side missions. It was like one of the, some guy was like collecting a bunch of different like birds and stuff. It was pretty annoying. It's like, oh, I think that these were, it was these birds. The blue hero, heroin was one of them, yeah. They only really spawned in this area. Um, okay, I need to find myself a... Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, I need to find myself a boat. Okay, I think I see something. Is that a boat? Or am I tripping? It is, okay. Those look like some real nice fishermen. I'm sure they're all innocent. I'm going to kill them all. Sorry. <laughs> that was kind of cold. It's okay, guys. It's just a game. Uh, okay, John can't... Oh, what the... Who's shooting at me? What? The train? It's one of the guards on the train. Okay, John can't swim. So, I have to do this quick. Okay, grab the boat, John. He can only swim for like a couple seconds. Okay, who's shooting at me? I'm gonna freaking die. I think I got him. I don't know who that was. Uh, okay. So, I got my boat. We're gonna try and make our way in the prison. I think... Is it that island over there? Yes, it is. Oh yeah, there's a legendary fish over here. I already got him. But as you can see, like it's crossed out because I caught it. But yeah, so I guess there is something over here. Uh, if you want all the legendary fish, you have to take a boat over here. Um, so yeah, okay, I guess, I guess there was something to do over there. Uh... Let's head on over. Can you steal that big boat? I don't know if you can. Um, I don't know if you can steal those bigger ones. Probably not. I'm curious though. Do you think? I don't want to like... I don't know. Should I investigate? Oh, I'm getting tired already. Damn, John does not have very good stamina. Ah, I think he's going to get away. He's pretty quick. I don't know how I would jump up on there. Is there like a ladder somewhere? I'm not sure. Hmm. Well, for another day or another video, perhaps we will do that. For today, we will continue our way to the prison. Well, and look, the waves get stronger too. It, it tries everything. The game tries everything it can to, to keep you from the island because you're not really supposed to come here. Except for the legendary fish, apparently. In that case, come on over. So yeah, you gotta be careful here. Now there are guards. Quite a lot of guards. Um, oh, I didn't grab my weapons from my horse. I meant to grab my, my good guns. Duh. Oh my god. He's way over there. What am I gonna do? Like, call my horse to me? Bruh. Okay, well, all I got is a pistol, I guess. Well, apparently they found me. Oh boy. Oh, and I only have my pistol. Jeez, I just walked right in the middle, apparently. Um, I didn't see them on the map. Oh, that's a prisoner. Well, guess he had a life sentence. Or a, a death sentence, is what I meant to say. Jeez. Oh, jeez.
Come on, prisoner. Oh no. Uh, this isn't going well. See, you can you can get over to like the main building. I'm not like the farm, but you can get over here. Um, there's a lot of guards over there. Let me see if I can. I'll try and make it over there for sure. Oh shoot, it's tough though. I just got my pistol. I'm not doing well on health. Oh. oh. Who does, uh, who does this alligator think he is? Oh, I, did I not use the, the fire bullet? Incendiary? Oh, he's dead now anyway. Uh, damn it, I was gonna, I was gonna, I was gonna burn him. Uh... Uh, okay. Poor bird. I found another victim. Should I just load up his body with lead? That was uncalled for. Alright, Buell. Don't let me leave without taking my freaking good guns, alright? I feel like I feel like I like the Springfield rifle. Is that right? Do I like this gun? Ah, uh, seems powerful. Oh, it is powerful. Uh, what's a good semi-automatic? Is that one pretty good? A semi-automatic gun. Hmm, yeah, maybe, maybe. Um, not really sure. This is a weird looking gun. It looks kind of modern. I don't know, it doesn't really matter. Sure, we'll take it. Alright, I got all that. Oh, well, I'll need the horse to. To swim me over there since John uh, can't swim for his life, since he will drown. We will go and try this one more time. All right, John, grab the boat, grab the boat, grab the boat. Oh, grab the boat! Thank God. Okay, throw this man overboard. This is our boat now. This is our boat. Okay, I got it. I gotta see. Uh oh. I'm on the big boat. My little boat's drifting away. If I can't, like, drive this, I'm afraid I'm gonna drown. Wait, I don't think I can. There were stairs there. Oh no, I'm getting nervous. Oh, I'll. I wanna drown. I wasted it. Shit, there's no door. John, oh my god, am I closer to the island? John, please just make that little swim. It's just a little swim. It's just a little swim. John? Oh my god. No, John, why? Why can't you swim at all? Just get back to the boat. Oh my god. Well, you know what they say, third time's charm. Um, I've approached from the right side this, this time, sort of, more from the bottom, but, so that's the main building there. And I got my weapons this time too, so that's good. And we now know that you can't steal the big boats. Uh, John sacrificed his life for that answer, so thank you, John. 
Let's have some of these <coughs> tonics. All right. Need to approach slow. I should have brought a rifle. I don't have one on me, but I should have brought the long range, long range rifle. Okay. Gotta be. Restricted area, it says. There should be a bunch of guys up there. I'm like right in the heart of it. <clears throat> when I came here on my own, there, there were tons of guards. They haven't, they haven't found me yet. Let me go. I don't know why he didn't just kill me on sight. Uh oh. Uh, Johnson. Uh, it is I, your superior officer. Oh fuck. I tried to. Oh fuck. <gasps> Yeah, they're swarming me now. Ooh. Oh boy. Oh. You see that that guy's head explode? Explosive bullets. Damn. Deadly AF. Look at this. is chaos chaos walking let me just get a vantage point up here maybe I don't think you can get inside though the prison I've never made it inside the walls before don't think you can get in there <sighs> sick triple kill Dude, I'm untouchable. Did I almost out? No worries. Got my... My tobacco. Apparently. And tonics. See, with all my tonics and stuff, I can actually last quite a while. Oh, shit. Yeah, there's not much left to do here. I've, uh... The enemies are just gonna keep respawning. I feel like I've kind of conquered the prison at this point. From up here. I can just keep killing these endless wave of enemies for a little while at least, so... You know what? Oh, I'm, I, I was hoping that would kill me. Uh... Do I have dynamite? Like, just... Ooh. I'll be like, uh... Hold on. Damn it! I was just hoping that I would get at least one guy first. <laughs> you know what would be a hilarious prank? If I threw a stick of dynamite at this officer over here. The look on his face will be priceless. Damn. Relax, everyone. It's just a prank. Damn, why is everyone shooting at me? It's just a prank, bro. <laughs> oh, no. I'm having a fist fight with this guy. Oh, I knocked him out. Okay, wow. Well, that just happened. Oh, 
That did not go how I... Is he already dead? He's already dead. Um, that was not what I had in mind. Okay. Um, well, I'm dead. Damn, I just flipped off my horse. That was crazy. I should have hit the record button a split second sooner. That was pretty funny, actually. Well, boys, looks like we got ourselves a standoff. Pile this guy. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. My horse! You bastards. Alright, boys. Last thing we're gonna do before we end this video. We have a train to rob. Train to hijack. Who? Me? You can't possibly be talking about me. Perhaps that wasn't smart. Now there's a fire in my path. Just run through it. Go, 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 go. I gotta get to the driver. What in the devil is that commotion? Get out of here, driver. You're lucky I'm sparing you. And we have. Done it. All right. And we can just ride this around to our heart's content. Um, I think there's a, another guard or two still on the train. And then you have a lawman chasing us. Anyway, uh, that will wrap it up for today's video. Um, I'll be back Sunday. Oh shoot, this guy's killing me. I'll be back Sunday for another episode of my... Uh, Uncharted Crushing Let's Play, Uncharted, Uncharted 2. Uh, I'll be back Monday for another episode of Mario Maker Monday. And then I'll be back on Wednesday, next Wednesday. I almost ran those guys. They got me. That's no fun. Um, that kind of sucks. Anyway, shit, I was going to try and end the video like with the whole train thing. Well, as I was saying, I'll be back Sunday for... An episode of uh, Crushing, uh, Uncharted 2 Crushing, let's play Monday for Mario Maker Monday and next Wednesday for a uh, Last of Us gameplay celebrating the 10th year anniversary of Last of Us. If you're still here, thanks so much for watching to the end. Hopefully you'll see you next time and have a great day.